Hey everyone, TechnoMentor here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to check how many devices are connected to Wi Fi. So let's get started. So, first thing you're going to do is go ahead and find your router IP address. So, usually it's in, if you're connected to it, you can go into your setting and then click on the Wi Fi and then click on that eye icon here and go down here and you'll see your router IP address. And you can go ahead and long press to copy. Now if you don't have this, you can also get it from basically your actual router, the physical router. You can go ahead and check to see the login IP it's going to give you there. You're going to look at it. Uh, depending on the model, it's going to be slightly different. Each of them will tell you your username and password. And once you know your username and password and the login IP, you're just going to go ahead paste in that IP. So whatever IP here, for example, I have a Netgear that I have set up. And then from there on, you're going to see username and password again either on the router or if you set it already to something else you're gonna go ahead and use that to log in so I'm gonna go ahead and use that to log in here I have mine usually a lot of times it's like admin and password is all the same but you'll find that info again on the router or if you already set it up you might already know this info and once you log in what you're gonna notice is depending on the the model that you have it's gonna look similarly something like this you're going to see a section which you can look around, browse on this page, but should say devices connected or attached device. Here, as you can see here, I have 10 different devices. And if I click on this, I can get into more details of basically what devices are connected and such. So you're going to have to browse around to look at attached devices and get through the page and you'll be able to see it will share basically a lot of details about devices that are connected, how many, which one, the type, all that info can be found there. So that's how you do it. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.